It's uh, January 11, 2020, 6.01 p.m. This is episode 750. I already started this video once and yet about maybe 10 seconds into it until I realized that the very first clip um, uh, tomorrow CNN cartoon was, was in the program, so I had to remove it. You'll get that one tomorrow or the day after or Tuesday. I don't know. You'll get it. You'll get it. Calm down. Calm down. Um, that was not very long either, though. I noticed it was about four minutes. <laughs> Let me explain why this one was longer than I had expected. <laughs> so I took it out. Uh, um, ba -ba -ba -ba. um, Trump is just, well, I did a cartoon yesterday and talked about how much he lies. Uh, and he lies, he lies, 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 just lies. I mean, but this is why he can't be trusted. I mean, about, oh, uh, this is why it just becomes a serious matter. Of course, he can't be trusted. Uh, it's just... It needs to be taken seriously that we cannot believe a president, our allies, and even our enemies need to believe our president. Um, right now, nobody believes him. Uh, even when it comes to this international stuff, in this international crisis, he continues to lie. Um, and, and he continues to lie over pettiness. It, this is not good. This, we, we cannot have a child as our president, and that is what's going on right now. Uh, and. The thing is, it, maybe it, it won't turn out that four embassies were targeted, but he started off with one. And then the next day, it was, it was four. I mean, you gotta get your story straight at least, you know, if you're gonna lie. I mean, Trump's not, this is why, uh, and this is the other thing that's a problem with him, he's not a good negotiator, he doesn't have a poker face. He doesn't even realize that his telltale signs of his lies, how we know that they are lies, you know. Um, when you know somebody really, really well, you can usually tell when they're lying to you. Uh, if they are a liar. Um, with Donald Trump, we know him pretty well because he's always in front of the cameras and he, and he won't shut up. And one of his telltale signs is that he changes his story. <laughs> and then it was no disregard to what the previous story was. And he's done this several times, a lot of times, you know. Um, just ignore what he previously said, you know. Kind of like with paying off the, the porn stars. I don't know anything about that. I don't know anything about that. Then they pay it off. And then later when it comes up, there's no acknowledgement of what he previously said. Uh, uh, from him or his or his people even and also his administration nobody will come out behind him and say yes four embassies were targeted they keep saying oh we can't talk about that because it's classified no it's not classified anymore you can say four you don't have to say where they are but you can back up the president and say there's four nobody wants to be caught in the lie because it's a lie that's another telltale sign it's a lie when you can't even get Kellyanne out there to say it was four embassies at least not yet she'll probably be out Monday or tomorrow on the news shows with her face all over the place um, cackling about it um, but nobody from the administration will say that there were four other than Donald Trump. And it has been declassified. They can say that there's four now because when the president says it, it's declassified. I mean, hell, if the president can declassify to the Russians, then you can go ahead and repeat what the, what the president said at, at one of his hate rallies. And also the movie's cats, that's just got to be really, really bad. <laughs> Uh-oh, we're almost done. I got to give some shout-outs to Ariel and, um, Robert Cortino. Uh uh, CNN did work, work me hard, but, uh, they needed to, I guess. Um, and yeah. Uh, and sorry, Robert, about your daughter and all that stuff with the, everything. Sorry I don't get time to read all this. I, I ranted about Trump too long. Come in and talk about that. Alright, everybody, uh, le click the red button and, um, become a subscriber. And if you leave a comment, I will give you a shout out. I will say your name on the internet. And yes, I am feeling better. Thank you, everybody. I ate some food today, actually. Bye.